There are a lot of ways to test a new truck, but really, in the end, there's only one that actually matters. Use it. So, we're going to give the all-new Ford Super Duty to real men with real jobs who work real hard every single day for companies like Halliburton, Florida Power and Light. These aren't guys who are going to drive it around the block and just kick the tires and tell us what they think we might want to hear. These are the kind of guys who get up in the morning and go to a mesa in Wyoming or a swamp down in Florida. They don't have resumes. They have scars. You know who I'm talking about, right? They're going to work this truck real hard. It's a good living, but it's a dang hard living. What we're doing here is we're, uh, we're going out to service a, a gas well. It's a 24-hour business, 365 days a year, and uh, these guys out here spend a lot of time in the front seat of these pickups. Uh, we get emergency calls 24 hours a day, and only having three individuals statewide to do that, we have to have equipment that's ready to go all the time. These trucks are our lifeline. You know, we can't have them leave us stranded out on the road. It's a matter of life and death. When it's 40 below zero out here and this truck dies, uh, you got about two hours to live. We run across alligators, snakes, angry customers. We just come from about 7,000 feet, climbed up to uh, about 7,600 feet on top of the mesa here. Pull loads upwards of 20, 22,000 pounds. Pretty extreme use of the truck. You can't recreate these conditions in a lab. We're gonna give it the run of its life. If it'll make it through us, I think it'll make it through anybody. It's gonna be real interesting to see how the new truck does perform. They're, they're already a tough pickup, and we want them tougher. Check back with me in a few months, and I'll let you know.